And today I'm talking with Marilyn Sanders, Dr. Marilyn Sanders, who um, is a neonatologist and presenting as a part of our prematurity course. She's presenting trauma-informed care in the newborn intensive care unit, promoting safety, security, and connectedness. I'm so glad you're here, Marilyn. Thank you for this opportunity, Kate. I'm very excited about being able to present to your audience. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm super excited to have you. And I, I've seen your presentation and I know, and I've talked with you and I've read your chapters um, and things like that. So, but why don't you tell our listeners a little bit more about you and what you're going to talk about at, in the prematurity course? Sure. I am a pediatrician and neonatologist. I've been in practice for over 30 years now, mm. and I've seen great changes in neonatology and in the newborn intensive care unit. Uh, I've seen us go from uh, a stage where very few of the smallest babies survived to now having excellent survivals uh, for even the smallest babies. But during the course of enhancing survival for the tiniest babies, a price has been paid. Mm -hmm. And the price ha that has been paid by both babies and families has really been in the realm of relationships. And so in my work, I focus on looking at opportunities to enhance the primary caregiving relationships of the baby with the family. And that's really my focus. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Well, I know your work is heavily flavored by the polyvagal theory, which I so enjoy. Um, and then I don't know if you want to just say a few words about about that, your polyvagal lens. Oh, absolutely. When I first read Stephen Porges opus, uh, his 2011 book for Norton, I was astounded that Stephen with the polyvagal theory had been able to give me a neurobiologic, neurophysiologic explanation for what I had been seeing clinically in the newborn intensive care unit. And he was also able, in the same way that Heidelise Owls has been able to, to give me a, an evidence-based rationale for the things that I have both done and that I have recommended doing. So in a very succinct way, the polyvagal theory is really about how our unconscious, automatic, or some people might think of it as autonomic, nervous system influences our feelings, our emotions, and our behaviors. And by our automatic nervous system, I'm talking about that portion of our nervous system that runs our basic functions, for example, keeps our heart beating, keeps us breathing, keeps our digestion going. Mm -hmm. But in addition to all that, those kind of basement utilities functions, the unconscious nervous system also gives us critical information that helps us assess whether at any given moment we are in a situation in which we are safe, whether we are in danger, or whether we are in truly a life-threatening situation. And not only in my own life and in my teaching, but I've also found that this can be extraordinarily meaningful working in the newborn intensive care unit, both in terms of looking at babies' behaviors. And remember, if you, if you know Heidi Lee Sals well, you know that to Heidi Lee Sals, Dr. Owls, of course, the baby's behavior is their language of communication, yes. as well as to understanding how parents feel and how staff reacts. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, it's going to be exciting to bring us all together in this transdisciplinary course, which was really inspired by you um, when I first met you and we talked about like what are the newest things that are coming down the pike when it comes to understanding babies. Mm -hmm. And you were the one besides us just loving talking about the polyvagal theory, which we both love about this transdisciplinary opportunity. So we really want to welcome you and thank you so very much for really being a part of um, this forward thinking, forward acting group. So well, we'll see everybody. Your presentation is March 10th. Mm -hmm. So we're very much looking forward to having you give your talk and also 
talk about your work further and uh, and be a part of our, our roundtable discussion. Lovely. So thank you. My pleasure.